Welcome to another edition of At Home Senior Fitness. I'm your, your host today, Steve Bottrell. Today we'll be working on exercise using a ball. The ball I have is this one, but you can really use any ball that you like. Anything that you find at home. You can use a tennis ball, a volleyball, any type of ball that you have. We'll be working also on our breathing. Now, I know everyone knows how to breathe, but today we'll learn how to breathe in the way that athletes do to minimize their stress level, bring their heart rate down. So we're gonna, we're gonna attempt to do that today as well. All right, let's put the ball down, let's get started. We'll start with a warm up, here we go, regular warm up, here we go. Get those legs going, get those arms pumping. We're getting the heart rate up. Good, now, you know, to keep breathing in through your nose, out through your mouth, always stay hydrated. And if you feel pain anywhere, just stop what you're doing. Maybe modify the movement or just take a break. And here we go. Let's push it. Two hands. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's march. Here we go. Good. You got it. Shake it out. Good. Couple of big breaths. Here we go. One more. Bring those hands together, interlock those fingers, right? We're rolling it. Remember, we're sitting up straight. We're engaging all those core muscles as we do this. And back the other way, we're gonna tap the toes as we do that. Upper body, lower body going together. Two different movements, get that brain thinking. Rotate those wrists the other way. And heels, this time we're tapping the heels. Good, and relax, stretch it. Really stretch it out. There's two, three, four, five, seven, one more, eight. Leave it out there. Fingers are going. We want to get those joints all limbered up. We're stretching and shoulders side to side. Playing the giant piano. Here we go. Good. Fingers are still going. Now we're going to shift it and push and push. Push as we do that. We're shifting our weight side to side, getting those hips involved. Here we go, side to side, bringing it down, still shifting that weight side to side, bringing it up. Here we go, a little bit higher, side to side, still shifting, maintaining your balance on the chair. Good, today we'll be working exclusively in the chair and march it. Here we go. Good. And relax. Big arm circles. Here we go. Bring it forward. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's go back for eight. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's bring it up and crisscross, stretching that chest, stretching the shoulders. Remember, we're not slouching and leaning. We're up nice and tall, engaging all those core muscles. Good, we're rolling the shoulders. Here we go. I'm rolling it backwards. One more, and let's go forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Good, let's bring it out. Stretching that back, leaning forward, back with a twist, pitching those shoulder blades, and push for two. Back. Three, pinching, four, five, six, good, seven, let's go one more for eight, push it out, bring it back, good, really stretch it, relax, let's pick up that ball now, whatever ball you decide to use, we're here, hand on either side, and squeeze it best you can, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now, fingers up, elbows up a little bit higher, ball still in our chest, we're squeezing it this way in one, two, three, four, good, five, six, seven, eight, good. Bring it out, straight arms here, Bend with a curling motion. Two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We push it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Push it down. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, and up. Good. Bring those feet together. We're up tall. Now, this is going to incorporate a back stretch with this one. We're keeping that ball on our thighs. We're slowly rolling it down, all the way down, over the knees, down the shins, all the way to the end of the toes. We're holding that stretch. Good. Bring it up. All the way up to the base of the neck. Now it's just have that gap so you can lean back slightly and bring it down. Here's two. Rolling it. All the way in the feet. Hold that. And all the way back up. Good. Leaning back up to the base of the neck. And down. Here we go for three. We'll just do four of these today. Hold that, bring it up, all the way to the base, here we go, leaning back, last one, here we go, all the way down, good, holding that, bring it all the way up, lean back slightly, good, here we go, now roll it to the end of that right knee. You see my cap on that knee. <laughs> All right. So we're going to place one hand on top of the other. We're going to push it straight down. We're just going to push down here. Remember, we're, we're up tall. We're working our shoulders here. And push. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one more, eight. Good, bring those knees together. Now, make some fists. We're going 10 and two with the fist, pushing straight down, two together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one more, eight. Now, bring the other knee out. One on top, the other, here we go. Push down, one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Back to center. Here we go. Ten and two. Do this again. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Take that knee out. Now this time, one hand, hand about the other. Now as you push down, we're going to raise the heel, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You should feel that more in your core area with that particular one. Taking it over. One hand out the other. Here we go. Push down and up with that heel. Two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. Let's just stay here. Roll that ball under the knee. One hand on each side of the leg. Now remember, you can use any type of ball that you like. You just decide how much you like to squeeze this. Here we go. It looks like this. Squeeze. Two. Three. Eight. Bring it down. Let's go to the other side. Here we are. One hand on either side of the leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One more. Eight. 
Good. Let's take that ball out. Who's here? We're gonna give it a squeeze and we're gonna flip it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one more, eight. On the other side, here we are. Squeeze and flip. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's just keep it in that hand and bring it back. Curl it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, one more, eight. Other side, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, straighten it up. Now watch this. Keeping that hand, that arm straight, place on top of the elbow bend, squeeze one, two, Three, four, good, five, six, seven, one more, eight. Other side, we're straightening it out. Ball will on top of that bend and squeeze one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, one more, eight, good. Take that ball in the hand, stretch it back to center, stretch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, one more, eight, leave it out there, good. Push it out, one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, and we're going up with it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Side to side. One, two, three, four. Put that ball down, other way. Relax, shake it out. A couple of big breaths, here we go. One more. Little march, here we go. We're just trying to cool it down, bring that heart rate back down. Here we go. Rolling those arms. We want to keep moving. We don't want to stop suddenly on this. We want the, those muscles to cramp up, but the heart to stop suddenly. So we're gradually bringing it back down till we do our breathing exercises. And backwards, good. And let's push it in. Good. We got it. And we're pushing. Good. Two more, one more. And two less marches. Shake it out. And we're rolling out. A little forward. We're right here, we're just going to tap those toes. Nice and easy. Bring it down. Heels. Tricky one. Heel and toe, alternating. Just makes you think a little bit. A little bit more coordination with this one. Good. You got it. And relax. A couple big breaths. Like I said, we're going to practice our breathing now. Breathing in an athletic type of form, or a lot of singers breathe this way, so then you hold those notes. Now, what I want you to do is hands on your stomach. As we're breathing in, our diaphragm comes out. And as we're breathing out, our diaphragm comes in. We're going to enter the nose, out to the mouth. Here we go. It's 
It's a little bit tricky to start with. That's why I have the hands there. Breathe it in for four and then out for four. It looks like this. This is a good way just to bring the heart rate back down to encourage you to breathe and breathe properly. A couple more times, here we go. One more, take it out for four. And then for four. One more time. Good, and relax, should be nice and loose now. Now, we're gonna keep that neck nice and loose. Here we go, we're gonna turn to the side. And back to the middle, one more. Back. Back. To the middle. Bring it down, and up, good. Let's shake it up. And just remember those breathing exercises at night. If, you, if, you, if you're having trouble getting to sleep, you can always try those breathing exercises. That'll, that'll control your, your diaphragm and your, your inhales and exhales. Thank you for joining me for another episode of At Home Senior Fitness. Tune in again next time when we do something fun and amazing with exercise. Thank you.